Hello. And this is the Bakto review. Well, unboxing. So, let's go. Alright, Bakto. This guy I've been anticipating forever because I like the bigger, bulkier Gundams, kind of like the Titus and, uh, I guess really just the Titus. But, um,. Uh, I, I was really happy to get this guy, but also sad that I can't build him right away because I'm leaving. Because I was going to put him priority over to uh, Spalo, but it is what it is. So let's go ahead and take a look, look at this guy. Move him out the way. Alright, Bakto. The front cover sold me instantly. You got him with his little Gatling guns right here. And you got his little beam cannon going underneath. Uh, I just... Ugh. This guy looks freaking awesome. What do you think, Garcia? Um, yeah, amazing. Yeah. You heard that? You heard that, YouTube? Amazing. If Garcia approves, then it's a good Gundam. Well, model. It's a good model. There we go. So you get a front and rear shot of it. Has a lot of the same qualities as the Gafram, but also different in terms of color and, um, you know, style. Transforms very poorly in my opinion. I don't think they should have even added a transformation because all it is is wings go up and its legs look like it extends out. That's really about it, and they call that a transformation. That's that's not a transformation. Yeah, foolishness, Dante. And here's this little tail that comes under and shoots cannons. And I guess this is like the little beam cannon as I see in the show. Let's go ahead and turn them around. So, here we go, little screenshots of him fighting uh, Genoese and destroying Genoese. But he got his ass janked by the Titus. And here he is with his little posse members. And him right there on the little stand. And uh, this guy retails for, I think, 12 how much? Oh, actually, looks like 15 75 But I got him for 11 80 So, bargain for the win. I think it's like 10% or something like that. Uh, you gotta find the places that have sales, man. I'm telling you. You know. I'm not, but if you shop online, then, yeah, just go to Hobby Link or, you know, places like that. I'm not a bit, I don't shop online, really. I think I, I think I shopped online maybe once this entire year. So. Yeah. Alright. Go ahead and take a look at the... Pieces. I really like the color, but I think if I'm, when I come back, I'm gonna get. It, I'm gonna buy another one and customize the color. Um, look, boss. The, the black looks really good. I like the black. It looks spot on. That aside, not many uh, runners actually. Look, one, two, three, four, five. Five runners. Tail and all that. Huge legs. Alright, and here's the box. Here. Open it up. We don't know who the pilot is either. One day we will, though. So, the mechanics it comes with different hands, like always. Weapons. And I guess these are the two guys that, that fought him in the series. I think it was uh, episode 8 or 7. One of those. I could be mistaken. Here's his color guide. Very simple. And some little poses right here. You know, I really wish they would give us a beam saber, you know, for, for the guy friend and all that. Because they use it in the anime, so why can't we get a piece? It would be so simple, wouldn't it? Garcia. Mm -hmm. I mean, it's right there. It's in. It's evidence. Like Phoenix Wright would say. More evidence. Anyways. Uh, this is Zadius. Spalo. Right. Simple instructions. Simple, simple, simple. That looks like an eye sword, my friend. It's pretty simple. Like, it's just boop. Too much Boop. black on there. Boop. I don't know. Way too much black. Alright. That's it. That's really about it. So 
So, uh, the only thing I have to say about this guy is whenever I go to Oki, I will be building him. So, yep, that's about it. So, stand by to stand by to stand by because uh, I need to get packed and ready to go. Alright, so I'll see y'all uh, probably in a week or so. Alright, ciao. Bye.